Welcome back. So I have a desk where I edit videos, do CAD, you know, productive work type things, but I've never had a desk mat or a mouse pad or anything like that underneath my peripherals. And luckily I've had pretty good tracking with the MX Master 3, but I felt like there was something missing to kind of bring my workspace together or add a little bit of extra something. And so I picked up a desk mat from ULX store. I've been following Alir for a while now and I really like the work that he puts out. And I think his products just look really good and they're well designed. So I knew when it was time to finally get a desk mat for myself, I was going to get one of his. I ended up going with the original desk mat in black since I thought this would be a good neutral color. Since I'm usually trying to get work done at my desk and it also doubles as my top down, setup, I didn't want to have anything brightly colored that wouldn't fit in in all scenarios or just be distracting in a shot. And when you open it up, it does come rolled up. So you'll have to give it a couple days to fully settle and sit flat on your desk. This feels really well made and the stitching on the edges feels pretty solid. And I like how the ULX logo is embossed on the bottom corner. It doesn't stand out too much and it's incorporated really well. It's there, but it's still subtle enough to where you won't notice it. It's not distracting or it won't kind of draw attention. And since it's made out of vegan leather, you're gonna have all the pros that come along with that, like a lower environmental impact, a higher durability and a lower cost relative to the full natural leather variant of this desk mat, which granted will give you a nice leather grain if you're into that and some natural patina that'll form over time. But when you get it rolled out and all set up, the mat itself is 40 centimeters tall by 80 centimeters wide which I think is a good size. It fits my keyboard, my mouse, and a couple other things like my phone and anything else I may need to have within the immediate vicinity while on my desk. And there's plenty of larger desk mats that cover up significantly more of your desk, but I like the way that the top of my desk looks. I wouldn't wanna cover up majority of it with a, with a, with a mat. And it's been really nice using this desk mat. I haven't noticed that the mouse tracks any differently, but I have noticed that it moves a little bit smoother than it did just on the wooden surface. And also I feel like it helps bring some separation into my desk so I can keep it organized with things that are on the mouse pad and then other things that I might have around. But overall, I really like this desk mat. It's clean, it's minimal, and it helps add some interest to the setup while also protecting my desk from any possible scratches that might be caused by my mouse dropping something. And if you're interested in picking one up for yourself, I'll be sure to leave a link down below the like button. But thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe for more videos about tech, cameras, and making. Here's a video comparing the M1 Max to its Intel predecessor. And here's a video that YouTube thinks you're gonna like the best.